All right then guys, how's it going? JT Judgment here and I am so happy to bring you yet another FIFA 15 Legend review. Today we're going to be looking at the 87 rated Portuguese beast that is Paul Letter. Now when it comes to using FIFA 14, or well, Paul Letter in FIFA 14, I didn't exactly enjoy using him. But a lot of you guys came to me saying that I was wrong and for them... Pauletta was one of the best striker legends in the game, but for me personally, guys, he really wasn't the best. He just didn't suit my style of play. But this year, he was a lot better. I found him to be a lot better this year. Going through his in-game stats, as you're seeing on the screen right now, he's got some pretty decent stats. 84 attack position and an acceleration. 85 jumping and reactions. 88 head and accuracy. 85 shot power. He's got some very, very good stats, guys. If you want to see his stats stat by stat, then all you have to do, guys, is rewind the video and pause on the stat that you want to see. Now, is he worth the coins? Currently, guys, he does go for around 350,000 coins. That's a pretty decent price tag in my opinion for a player that has these sort of stats i mean he's got 82 pace 86 shooting and i think it's 78 or 79 dribbling uh so stats like that on a striker a legend striker and for him to go for around 350k it sounds like it's a bit of a bargain guys but is he worth the coins and does he play well on the pitch let's go into his positives and negatives i'll go through his negatives first guys his uh, long shots for me weren't the best. Now, you guys know me by now. For those of you that have been subscribed to me for a long time, you will know that I love taking long shots in FIFA. It's how I play, you know. It's how I find the game exciting and fun to play. Scoring long shots is one of my favourite things to do in this game. And no matter how bad a player's long shots and shot power stats are, I will always attempt taking long shots with a player no matter what their stats are uh, and Pauletta for me he really didn't do the job he done the job once or twice for me but unfortunately for me like I've experienced a lot so far in this year's FIFA I hit the post again and again so, unfortunately, there won't be any long shot goals in this video. Um, but, you know, shooting from a distance for me, it really wasn't the best. Like I said, he did come close once or twice. Uh, but if you compare that to the amount of long shots that I did take with this card, then that is very, very poor. His aerial ability for me wasn't the best. I mean, he's got a very good head in stat, guys, and a jump in stat. He's got 85 jump in and 88 head in accuracy. But his aerial ability for me was crap. I mean, when it came to, you know, heading from corners, he never jumped to get the ball and he never made contact with the ball uh, and when it came to crossing the ball inside the box he never attempted to get the ball guys so his aerial ability for me was really really bad and one of the biggest downsides that I did find with this card is that he never makes runs now his positioning for me was half decent I mean he was always there in the striker position that I needed him to be in but he would never actually you know finish the play by making the run so that would kind of ruin the plays slightly for me and it did you know stop a lot of uh, stop me from scoring a lot more goals uh with this card now pretty much everything else that i found with this card was a plus his pace is fantastic 82 pace on the card but in my opinion it feels like at least 84 maybe even 85 so you really don't have to worry about go buying this card um and him not feeling as fast as what his pace card uh pace stat on his card does suggest for me guys he really did outperform his pace stat his finishing inside the box for me was fantastic and it was fantastic on either foot he's got three star skills on four star weak foot his weak foot for me i had no problems with inside the box that is guys when it came to shooting from a distance with his weak foot i did try uh but unfortunately for me it just failed on every single occasion so you know when it comes to using his weak foot he will probably fail uh, from a distance for you guys but inside the box you shouldn't really have anything to worry about his dribbling and ball control for me was insane you will see from the goals guys in this video his dribbling and ball control is fantastic and it played a major role in the goals uh, that I did score with him and you will be e you know you'll be able to easily dribble through defenses with this card and for 78 dribbling it is a lot better guys a lot better in my opinion it feels as though it's in at least the mid 80s it was fantastic for me surprisingly his strength was very good for me he did manage to keep the ball and hold his own against center backs that i honestly you know um expected him to lose the ball too so that made me enjoy him that much more that was a very big surprise and one of the biggest surprises that i found with this card 
is that his passing is phenomenal as well. Now, Pauletta turned out to be the sort of striker where if you use two strikers, he was the striker that turned out to be the one that assisted the other striker the most. You know, I tried using Pauletta as Shevchenko in the same team. Shevchenko was my long shot taker slash finisher, whereas Pauletta was my occasional finisher, but more of my assister. I think in the 15-16 games, um, he managed to score about 16 goals, and I think he got 14 or 15 assists for me, which was crazy. I've given him a final score of 8.9 out of 10. I thought this guard was absolutely fantastic. He was much better for me this year compared to last year. I had a fantastic time using this card. Um, and if you pick him up, guys, I don't think you'll have any problems other than his long shots aren't the best, his aerial ability isn't the best, and just keep in mind that he may not make the runs that you need him to make uh, at the times that you need to make them, guys. And that's going to wrap up this legend Pauletta review, guys. If this did help you decide uh, whether or not to buy him, as always, a like is greatly appreciated. Subscribe now for more legend reviews to come in the future, guys. And as always from me, please take care, and I will see you all next time. Ta-da, guys.